Yo, what's going on, Sexy Samuel? It's quite today we're here doing a rank, the one v one. I realized I haven't played Hoi in a long time because I always ban him. You know, like every single game, I just ban Hoi. So I figured, you know what I'm gonna do for you, lovely, lovely people. You, you gorgeous, gorgeous people. I'm gonna play some Hoi. I'm, I'm gonna play a little bit of Hoi. He's Sukiyomi, so obviously I'll go Aegis. Uh, am I that mana hungry? I don't think I'm that mana hungry. I think I'd rather have, uh, oh my god, I only have five power with this build. <laughs> but you you do extra auto attack damage because of Hunter's Blessing, but only having five power is kind of, you know. But that's alright. That's alright. Alright, we should be able to clear really fast. I'm even gonna jump and go for the uh, the double buff clear, because he does clear pretty quick himself. Um, I missed up the triple bounce, which sucks. He clears pretty quick himself, but... Oh, he's going straight into Soul Eater. Not going Devos, or... Uh, not Devos, I'm sorry, or Transcendence. Sorry. Get a lot of damage there. Alright. Fine by me. I feel like that one shouldn't have hit me, but whatever. I got level 5, so now he doesn't scare me. Better back up, dog. Wow, I actually hit the stun. And it was out of range. Unlucky. Um, alright, I'm just gonna back here. Yeah, I'm just gonna back. I just wanted to make sure he wasn't, like, doing any shenanigans. Alright, so... My damage is pretty low. Especially compared to him. Early game Tsukiyomi always does a lot of damage. He does a lot of damage late game as well, but early game and mid game is where he really, like, flourishes. So, be a little bit careful. Nice, I hit him and the minions. I was only going for the minions, but he walked into it, so I'll take it. Ouch. I'm just trying to bounce for minion damage. Oh wait, it doesn't do extra minion damage, does it? Anymore. Okay. Honestly, I want you to fight me. Alright, nice. Very good, very good, very good. I wanted him to fight me there. He only hit one of his, uh, one of the ticks of his ult, so I was pretty confident that him teleporting to me and not being able to do that much damage would be beneficial for me not for him obviously there's a chance it could have been beneficial for him where he could have just like completely smacked me up teleported to me used his one and his two and just done so much damage to me um i definitely wouldn't count that out but i think that basically what happened was he missed the first three got a little flustered in my opinion just by the look of his play Get a little bit flustered that he missed the first three, and then once he did hit me and teleport, he just decided to try to run, and he was way too far out of position to be able to run. Ouch. Even in the shadow, 
I think I'm okay with this. I'm just trying to get some healing, you know? Ah, oh, that hit me. If that didn't hit me, I definitely would have killed him. Oh, traded. Ooh. You know, honestly, well played. I think he used his shell there, which is what gave him enough time to actually trade with me. But I also think... Oh, speed's not up. I also think um, trading kills there is actually better for me. It is straight up. I think just straight up better than for me. Because I, late game I win, right? Like, he wins early in mid-game, and then late-game I have a slight advantage, I think. Yeah, he's got his Soul Eater now, so he's going to be stacking that a lot quicker than I am. thought he was going to juke, but he didn't. Yeah, he gains a lot more stacks than I do. Red buff just spawn, though. I don't know if he knows that. Doesn't seem like he does. I'll use my one earlier so I can get the cooldown up earlier for the red buff, obviously. He has no mana, so he's not fighting this. This is just going to be mine. Which is very good for me. And if he does decide to fight this with his ult, then I just win because I have Aegis and my ult to counter. Which I think is the play that I'm going to be doing pretty much all game is if he ults me, my counter play to his ult is just ulting my feet and stunning him in my ult. Don't try to jump away or do any cheeky shit, you know, just jump away, stun him in my ult. I think that's... By far the best play I could possibly do. He's going into defense here, which is a good play. Oh, annoying. But also not a big deal. Okay. Oh, missing the one blows. But I'm doing a lot of damage actually, so maybe it doesn't matter. Nice kill, dude. Nice kill. Hell yeah. Auto this tower a bit. I don't know. Are we able to get tower here? I don't want to stay too long. Yeah, we can definitely get tower here. I just don't want to stay too long because if he ults me, I will die. I don't have the mana to fight back, even with Aegis. Even with Aegis, I think I'll, I'll lose that fight. I'm going to go Ichabal instead of defense, by the way. Ichabal is really going to give me so much... Uh, We'll just go Bracer. But Ichabal's going to give me so much more power over him. Like, whenever we're fighting, I'll definitely be in the lead. Which is really good. Like, if you can take the the mid game away from a, from a Tsukuyomi, then you're in a great spot. And I feel like I have the mid game down right now. The early game was a little iffy. You know, I was losing the push battle. I was losing the poke battle. But because I double buffed, I was able to hit level 5 before him. And, uh, and regain pressure. <coughs> Excuse me. Regain pressure off of that. So. I don't know. I'm feeling pretty good right now, actually.
<laughs> That's why I hate Hoi, dude. That's why I hate Hoi. You just do stupid fucking bounces and get kills. Like, that definitely should not have worked, but it did. Nice bounce. It wasn't calculated. But thank you for thinking it was. Really boosting my self esteem. <laughs> definitely not calculated. Damn it. Nice blocks. I think he blocked like five auto attacks, dude. God damn. <laughs> um, he doesn't have any anti-heal yet. I have Bracer and Devos. I don't need Atalantas yet. I, I don't... He's not that tanky. I'm gonna go Berserker Shield. It's just a li it's a little bit of defense. It's only, you know, it's 30 protection. It's not that much. But it does give me a little bit of pen, 10%, and 20% attack speed as well, which is not bad. Not to mention the 40 power is not bad either. I definitely do not want to pick up blue. I assume he already has red buff, though. Yeah, he does. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. Max cooldown. That max cooldown is doing a lot. Actually, maybe instead of this, I should go for some max cooldown. Red shield's not very good. Maybe I'll just go. Your middle tower is under attack. Hmm. Your middle tower has been destroyed. I don't know yet. He had a red buff, I still took that fight, that was dumb. Maybe I'll go Toxic Blade. You know, a little bit of HP. I'll go Toxic Blade because he has Soul Eater. He's going Beat Stick right now. Hmm. Question is, what do I want? What's best for me here? Going Hydras. Might be a Heart Seeker, but I assume it's a Hydras. I think I'll probably go. I mean, he doesn't have Thorns, right? So this should be an okay fight. I don't want to fight. I have too much gold. I have too much gold in hand. I want to fight. Let's go toxic. I 
think I will probably just sell my... I think I will sell my Berserker Shield for, for Breastplate. I think cooldown is underrated. Or I am underrating it in this matchup. He's max cooldown. I think I will actually get Berserker Shield right now. Because I, I can't sell this for full Breastplate, but Berserker Shield itself will give me a spike. Um, my attack speed's pretty up there. Upgraded his thorns. Okay. Less life steal for me. I mean, obviously landing the stun is what's gonna win me the game. Like if I land the stun, then I do more damage to him than he does to me. His alt is down. <clears throat> His alt is down and I haven't used anything. So I'm going to try to win the game here. This fight might get close though because he does have upgraded thorns. Keep that in mind. So I decided to Aegis. Dude, if that stun hit. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, the soul leader. Oh, shit. Oh, oh! Oh my god, the ending to that match, that last fight, that last fight, dude, oh my god, GG, <coughs> holy shit, that last fight was intense, oh my god, I don't, I, Jesus Christ, I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time, guys, I'll see you, peace, Jesus, fuck, goodness gracious.